They're off away in racing for our first race this afternoon, the Moneyweb Conditions Race over a distance of three miles, and leading them towards the first fence is Get On The Jaeger in the predominantly green jacket. Get On The Jaeger with William Silby on board, leads them towards the first fence, which will be the last one in two circuits time. Silvertown is in the second position in the light blue season, and then Benefactor moves into second with Gina Andrews in the saddle aboard the pink and green colours. That is Gina Andrews. Silvertown on the inside in third position in fourth place is Wishful Freeling in the pink and green. And then Town Salazi in the white and brown behind those Camdoni in the odd old favourite in the maroon and green jacket in sixth position at this stage. They turn away from the enclosure. And at the rear of the field of this stage is Valley Watson. About a seven length top to tail there is he's the first quarter mile behind them, then two more and six on the left to right. Get on the edge of them, lead the way towards the second obstacle, and the second position of this stage is Silver Town. On the outside there, the green and the um, green and pink jacket, the senior Andrews in the saddle, is um, the second favourite benefactor, who's 11 to 10 at the off, we head now towards the third fence. Still get on the Jaeger, who leads the way. Benefactor in second position, Silvertown moves into third, Wishful Dreaming in fourth, and Camdonia in fifth, and then comes Stella B, and behind those is Valley Watson, who's about two lengths behind the leading sex test. They head towards the service one on the um, side, running away from the um, enclosures, the fourth fence, kindly sponsored this afternoon by McLaren. So they head with two and a half miles left to run in the Money Web Conditions race. First race this afternoon. Get on the Jaeger, leads the way as Will Tilby in the saddle. From in second position, Benefactor and Gina Andrews. And then in third at this stage, who's always been up close in Camdonian and the maroon jacket with Charlie Tanet on board. So head now towards the um, fifth fence. And over it they go. Now moving into the lead is Benefactor and Gina Andrews, who out jump Get on the Jaeger at the fifth there. Camdonian is in third position, and then about a half a length back. To wishful Dreaming in four, then the Grey and Stella V, and on the inside, Silver Town, the Sally Watson has now drifted five legs behind the leading six runners as they now head with about two miles and two songs left to run. Benefactor, it is said, who leads the way with Gina Andrews on board by about a length to get on the Jaeger and Will Silby in the darker green jacket. Heading now towards the next obstacle, which will be number seven, currently sponsored by Spillers. This is the Spillers Fence. Heading towards it now, and it is Benefactor who leads the way. Get on the Jaeger in second, and Camdonian in third over the Spillers fence. In between those, in the pink cap, is Stella B, who's moved into fourth position. Wishful Dreaming into fifth. Outside there is the black and white stripes of Silver Tan. Valley walks in, still very much in contention. He's only about five lengths off the leading six. They come to the next obstacle, number eight, is led on still by Benefactor. By about the length now in second position is Get on the Jaeger. He's closing up on this leader. Then in third is Camden. It's very tightly bunched indeed as they head towards their um, ninth obstacle. Benefactor leads the way in towards the humble potato fence and still has the lead over it. And now goes two lengths to the good of Camden in second. And then in third position, Get on the Jaeger. And in fourth is Celebi. Heading around the bend to go through their departure point, leaving their first mile and three thorns behind them now. And Benefactor still has the lead. Turning to run toward in front of the enclosures, towards the CW Stickland fence. Here they come. Benefactor has the lead. Silver Tower into second position. Get on the Jaeger. The South Jump Camdoni there. So it is Benefactor and each in the second position is a get on the year. You have third, two, and a root back of Camden, Stella B, the Grey, moving into third position. Camden, you fourth, and now fifth, two wishful dreams, still a town in sixth position, and Valley Watson has probably been pulled up, I think, somewhere in, in the last furlong or so. So led on now by Benefactor, who has the lead, get on the Jaeger, is trying to get on third for Junior Andrews and Benefactor, will still be, and get on the Jaeger in second position. They're up to five, very little between them as they head away from the enclosures towards their tenth um, obstacle into the fire sports fence. They head along the um, side away from the enclosure. Benefactor leads, get on the A, the middle between these two. Camden is in third, about a length in third position. Then a third length back to Silvertown, who's moved into fourth position as they go over the 11th obstacle. So Silvertown with George Atkinson on board, the 21 shot is currently in fourth position. Valley Watson has, I can confirm, been pulled up. 
all position of Silver Town, then the two front of those are Camden, each fist then to Salazie the Grey, and then behind the, at this stage, Wishful Dreaming, is still very much in contention as they head with about um, seven pills left to run in the Money Web Conditions race. The first race of the afternoon. Silver Town has moved up to join Camdonian, but it is still a benefactor to lead the way as they head on with three quarters of a circuit left to go. Camdonian is a benefactor to lead the way from Get on the Gagan in second position. Camdonian, the oddball favourite with Charlie Finesse on board, is three lengths behind the leader in third position at this stage. And then in fourth um, is moving through Wishful Dreaming. Then Silver Town moves into fifth position, and the grey of Stella V is just behind those, and very much in contention with William Brown on board, is Stella V as they head um, over the open ditch. And we have a faller there, Stella V, a very bad fall actually, because he got tangled in his um, reins did and William Brown, and he fell off Stella V, but he that was come off and at the open ditch, as they now head on with four left to jump in the many web conditions um, race, and there's only five left as Stella V fell five from home. It is Camdonian up by Benefactor now. So, Benefactor and Camdonian come in from four from home, and it is Camdonian just out of Benefactor. Benefactor just about has the advantage here on the far side of the pink trail. Camdonian in second in the maroon jacket with Charlie Finesse on board. They head to three from the finish now. Camdonian on the inside. Benefactor, a better jump there. And Benefactor has to lead by quarter of a leg to Camdonian in second. Silvertown has moved to third. Kevin Yeager is tiring in fourth place. And they are the only um, ones to be continuing at this stage. Meanwhile, sorry, Wishful Dreaming has moved into third position. It's Camdoni who leads the way over the penultimate fence. Benefactor trying to dig deeper here under Gina Andrews and Jockey a Jockey Ship. They head round the home bend. A fog and a half to run. Camdoni in the maroon jacket. On the inside, Benefactor. Wishful Dreaming in third. Silver Town still going in fourth. Heading towards the final fence, sponsored by CW Stickland. And it is Benefactor on the inside. Camdoni in the maroon on the outside. Charlie Finesse in the saddle. Here's the left. And here's Camdoni to stop the better of that leap here. Camdoni coming clear now, three legs clear of Benefactor. And Camdoni is the best today. And just the time, worthy favourite of Camdoni and Charlie Finesse with Benefactor in second position. Third to Wishful Dreaming and Silver Town will come home in fourth.